good day to you. It's once again book week 2021. We need to appreciate everything we have and we cannot be greedy. Let me tell you a story. Once upon a time in a small village lived a woman who named Sophia. Sophia was a milk lady and she owned a cow sheep which left by her parents. Sophia took over take care of all the cows after her parents passed away. She fed them good taste and nursed them well. Due to this, all of Sophia's cows would produce excellent quality of milk. Everybody in the village would buy milk only from Sophia. Therefore, Sophia continued earning well and lived a good life. However, Sophia was not happy what she had. She always dreamt to buy a big house, expensive clothes, and many servants to serve her. Sophia told her best friend named Lily about her thoughts. Lily stopped and told Sophia. This creature gave you nowhere. You earn and you should be happy with what you have. Sophia did not understand how can she be happy in this small and this old smelly cow shape. But this is your life you I saw it for living. It's a smelly job too. But I don't mind it. It's my work. Sophia murmured that. Well, well, well. Then maybe you're meant to sell eggs. Each day as Sophia went, to sell milk, the villagers would praise her that her milk is so good, tasty and healthy. Sophia in a hurry to earn more money. She often tried to find a way to become rich. I'm selling milk. Oh, hi, can I buy a bottle of milk? Okay. Thank you. What? So less? Hmm. How do I sell more milk? There has to be some way. I have to increase the quantity of the milk. How do I do that? Sophia had an idea to mix a little water in the milk. I will be able to sell more milk to earn more money. It's a brilliant idea. Sophia shared her thoughts with Lily. Nobody would notice if I just add little water in it. Ha ha ha. This way will take you nowhere, my dear friend. The sooner you understand, that better you should just appreciate what you have it now. But I have wasted enough time here. All the best to smelly egg business. Goodbye. The next morning, Sophia began to fill her containers with milk, but this time she only filled them half. And then she went to the river and added a little of water in it. That day, just like always, the villagers happily bought milk from Sophia and came 
eat her the same amount. That night, Sophia was very happy as she had double her income. Days passed. Sophia now was richer than before. She was used to adding water in the milk that she did not think for buying another cow even once. The villagers began to notice there was chatter in the village about the new watery milk. Very soon, it spread to the whole neighboring village. Slowly, everybody stopped buying milk from Sophia. Now, Sophia was a poor milk lady. She had only a handful of cows left. Now you realize what you have done. Your greed is the reason that you are poor. I agree, Lily. I should have listened to you. I did not just lose my money. I also lost respect and trust of the people. Hmm. Hope you enjoy my story. Bye.